Severe weather Sunday brings the first tornado of the year to Kansas. The National Weather Service confirms the touchdown one mile south southeast of Liberal. Yeah, and these are images of the funnel clouds right here captured from our viewers in Liberal. As you can see, it brought in rain, strong winds and gusts across the state. Jason's Mally Jones spoke to one man in Liberal who shows us the damage the tornado did to his house. Eddie Julia, he says it all happened in a matter of minutes. He tells KSN multiple things flew through his windows and there's a small hole in the side of his house. Next to two windows, I saw stuff flying. Joshua Bolden says he was sitting on the couch next to the windows, not knowing what was going on. This is exactly where I was at. I, the power went out. I looked over and I saw stuff flying towards the windows and I ran to the other side of the house. He says he didn't hear the tornado sirens until after the damage was already done. The hole on the outside of my house, and then I have uh, in my son's room, there's two fence boards stuck all the way through the wall. He says he thought he had a lot of damage, but then he walked outside and was shocked to see his neighbor's house. Yeah, the whole roof over his garage and his living room has gone, and then he had a metal shed like shop building next to it and that's pretty much all destroyed too. He and his neighbors say it was loud. Every neighbor that I talked to said that they heard uh, their ears popped and they said it sounded like a freight train. The Seward County Emergency Management Director tells us four to five homes in Liberal have moderate to severe damage and another 10 to 12 experienced moderate damage. He says one person had minor injuries and was treated and released. We will keep you updated as more information becomes available. Here for you, Mally Jones, KSN News 3.